Hello, my name is John Thuma, Director, Analytic Solutions, Arcadia Data. Today we are going to review an Arcadia Enterprise feature called Smart Acceleration and Analytical Views. Data has evolved, data platforms have evolved. So why stick with your existing BI tools that were designed for traditional environments? Enterprises today are seeking a modern approach to analytics and BI for their modern data platforms. Arcadia Enterprise sets a new BI standard for data lakes beyond the traditional data warehouse tools that you already use. Reduce the complexity of analyzing big data with Arcadia Enterprise. Traditional BI tools on the data lake come with big challenges. Data lakes have massive data sets of varied complexity and size. Hundreds to thousands of users are hungry to exploit the data lake. Combine these two factors contribute to performance issues of traditional BI tools on the lake. Refreshes of dashboards can take minutes to hours to complete, or often never come back at all. So what do we do? We move data into the BI server, or to an OLAP cube. These tools require vast human technical talents and are complicated. Often you have to move and copy data to other platforms to make them work. The solution is Arcadia Smart Acceleration, which lets you break through those barriers and support hundreds to thousands of concurrent users with sub-second response times. Smart Acceleration does all the hard work. It creates optimized analytical views, which are derived from data access and usage heuristics and recommendations. Smart Acceleration requires no coding expertise, and data never leaves the data lake. Let's jump into a real demo. We will be using the TV Viewer dataset consisting of eight fields with 270 partitions, containing over 1 billion records. We're using a four node cluster that is in the cloud. Let's click and look at the TV viewing data full table. From here, we can look at the sample data, review table statistics, and the partitions. We can see the partition details such as number of rows, format, and location. I will then click on the dataset tab and open the TV Viewer DS dataset. Once in the dataset, let's click the analytical view tab and make sure we don't have analytical views built for this dataset. Click Related Dashboards tab and let's run our non-optimized dashboard. Let's note the start time of 12.26 and 52 seconds on June 13, 2018. This dashboard consists of three filters, four visuals, and one non-SQL visual, the clock. The entire dashboard will take about 44 seconds to render. That means almost every click or filter operation will take 44 seconds or more to render. This is unacceptable, and this is only against 1 billion records. The filters across the top finally were populated for channel, program, and date stream. You can see the active progress of the visuals below coming to life. Again, 44 seconds is too slow. Now let's optimize this dashboard. Select the Visuals tab on the top gray bar. To optimize a dashboard is simple. Select the dashboard you want to optimize and select the three dots to the right of the Delete button on the top bar. Choose Smart Acceleration and the Recommendation Manager will appear. Give it a few seconds to review the dashboard and all of its available artifacts. All the visual objects will appear with a Recommendation Summary and Execution History. You can verify that none of the objects are accelerated. Click Get Analytical View Recommendations. You can now click on the SQL button to the right of the visual list and review how the Recommendation Manager will build its analytical views. Scroll down and we can take a look at the recommended analytical views. Click the Details button and let's investigate. We can look at the score details and advantages. It also gives you a rating system to score its value. We can look at base table information and the SQL used to build the analytical view. Once you are satisfied, click the Create Recommended Analytical View button and Arcadia Enterprise will build the analytical views. We click Refresh and we are done. Also note that any dashboard can take advantage of these analytical views. This includes other third-party BI clients and tools. We didn't write a single line of code or move data from the platform. In a couple of minutes, we can test our dashboards and see the results. 
After a couple of minutes, the analytical views are done. You can delete the view or schedule a job to refresh the view. Click the Visuals tab and let's open up the dashboard and review the performance improvement. Click and open the dashboard and you will see that the dashboard now renders in roughly two seconds or less. We went from rendering in 44 seconds to just under two seconds. Notice that the performance stays consistent as we click the different filter options. Again, we didn't write a single line of code. We didn't move data off of the cluster. We didn't have to build any OLAP cubes or complex in-memory solutions. Check us out at ArcadiaData.com for more details. Thank you very much.